Okay, gentlemen, um, I have constructed a little catch can that uh, goes underneath my uh, road draft tube just so I can avoid some leakies and shit, just so the driveway stays clean. I've got some like schmoo in here, and it looks like motor oil, but it looks kind of diesel-y, and my nose is shot. I can't smell it just because... I don't know, huffing too much paint or something. <laughs> but, um, so I heard an easy test to see if it's motor oil or diesel is to light it on fire. And if it burns easy, then it, um, it is diesel. So we'll see. I got the obligatory lighter. That's pink. And we'll see. I hope this doesn't burn down my shot. I don't know. Didn't really do anything. I don't want to get too close. I don't know if it's like gas or it'll fucking. Because even though diesel is a compression based fuel, it does have a certain amount of um, flammability. I'm really not seeing anything. We're getting in there. I don't want to burn the fuck out of my finger here, but. Okay. Uh, let me figure something out. Now we can get right up in there. Right. Okay. See, it's got a very thin consistency. I'm wondering if it's diesel mixed with oil. I'm wondering if my lift pump has gone bad and it's lit and you see all that shit's just from the workbench. But I'm wondering if like the seal went through and it's dumping diesel or uh, diesel into my oil. But I don't know. Another test, it's called the halo test. So what you need is a paper towel, which, you know, I obviously prepared because I'm a professional YouTuber. Ah, yes. Towels work as well, like paper towels or printer paper. We're doing that. So basically the concept is when you drop it on there, you're going to see a center ring of oil. The diesel is more viscous and it likes to leach out. So you'll get like a center ring. Maybe even too much. You'll get like a center ring and then the diesel will expand. Now I'm really not seeing that. We'll let it sit and see what happens in about 10 minutes. <laughs> 10 minutes or one beer. Also, I upgraded. I've got a little tripod. So. Okay, it's been about uh, one beer. And okay, so we got definitely a separation. Now, if I'm reading, it should be a lighter uh, color, meaning you the diesel. Well, let me get my professional pointer here. The diesel right here, if it is diesel, would be like a brownish. And it is grayish. But this center here is, I think it's, I think it's just pure oil. I mean, I don't really see the fucking, any really different colors, honestly. I think that's just, hmm, okay. Well, it's not the lift pump. I'm trying to hunt down a mileage problem. I'm wondering if my, if my fuel's going into my tank, but then I would be overflowing. See, the problem is, I'm getting poor mileage, uh, and I have uh, a persistent oil leak that it's originating from, I think, this injector here, because it's all shiny. It's hard to see. The second injector, or rather the port from the injectors are over there, but this is the second feed port. Now, I'm not sure what the, uh, the num clencher is technically, but this position here, it's hard to show. I th it's leaking, and I wonder if the seal's going bad and it's dripping down past the injection pump and then sitting onto the rail where the oil pan bolts up, dripping down, and that's where the, the uh, road draft tube goes through. Oh. So this is, <laughs> this is my little mechanism just so I can catch all the schmoo dropping out of there. Cause I hate fucking drips. It's a pain in my ass. See, there's another one. There's a fuck another one. So 
I know it's a diesel, I know it's a cum engine, it's supposed to leak, but no. So, okay. Now, I might have to be pulling on the injection pump and resealing the tappet cover. That's my next idea. That, and I think my timing has slipped. So, alright. That's what I'm dealing with now. Got the fucking stove going. I'm trying to stay warm. Tinkering around. Okay, boys. Uh, fucking like me up. I need some views. I need some likes. I want. I want to. I want to get out there and uh, have this take off. It'll be a good um, distraction. I need a hobby. And I think making videos like this would be nice. But anyway, enough of my insane rambling. Um, all right, fuck off and die.